The Times Cricket Shield 85th award ceremony took place in Mumbai, various teams in six divisions of the tournament were felicitated by a chief guest, former Indian captain Dilip Veng Sarkar. It began 85 years ago in 1930 with just one division and 20 teams. A nurturing platform for several young cricketers, the Times Cricket Shield today had grown to six divisions with 152 teams. When they started this tournament, it basically was to encourage employment for cricketers. And it's into the 86th year now. And it's an important tournament because it provides a platform for cricketers uh, to showcase their talent, uh, get employed. And this season, Jain Irrigation Systems winning the A division of the Times Cricket Shield. Jain Irrigation Systems Limited bagging the Times Cricket Shield. We are very proud that we won the Time Shield. We started with the C division, we won the C division, then we come up in the B division, we won the B division. Now it was our dream to win the A division and we did that, so I'm extremely happy. While Praveen Tambay's D.Y. Patil group clinched the B division of the prestigious tournament. The winners of the B division are D.Y. Patil Group B. Times have uh, uh, given so much opportunities for the cricketers in Mumbai actually. Because I have performing over the years uh, in time shields and that was recognized by a D.Y. Patil and I have joined the D.Y. Patil because of time shield only. Various teams in six divisions of the tournament were felicitated by chief guest, former Indian captain Dilip Eng Sarkar. It's a very important tournament. Um, um, uh, uh, the calendar of Mumbai cricket. Basically, um, it provides a great platform to all the young cricketers of Mumbai. Um, you know, and get a lot of recruitment, recruitments, basically, uh, uh, yeah, job opportunities to a lot of cricketers. In a country where cricket is the most revered sport, tournaments like the Times Cricket Shield provide a platform to those who play cricket for their passion and also an opportunity for the young to make their mark. Sports Bureau, Times Now.